Well, Missile Command to me was, it was a lot of fun, but it was also a serious matter. And when Atari asked me to do the game, I one of the things I said was, this is going to be a totally defensive game. It's not going to be an offensive game. I refused to do something where I had sent off missiles to attack the USSR. Um, so he said, fine. So it's it's a totally defensive game. And to me, then it's, it's moral. You're defending your country against attack. Um, but the thought of um, what actually happens when there's a, a nu- you know a nuclear attack is, is terrifying. And working on the game for six months, uh, I internalized a lot of the stuff. So I I have nightmares about nuclear attacks. You know, I, I in my dream I'd see a white streak going across the sky, just like in Missile Command, and I'd be up hiking in the mountains and I'd see it hit in the valley, like in Sunnyvale, and I'd see the explosion, and I'd and I'd know that the blast was going to hit me in like 15 seconds, and I'd wake up in a cold sweat. And this happened quite frequently when I was doing the game, and then it tapered off after the game, but still, you know, I had them for a couple of years afterwards, maybe one every two, three months. So it was, it was a sobering experience. 